uh, such a great opportunity. Thank you very much. And uh, Honorable Prime Minister of India, Narendra Modi, Honorable uh, Chief Minister of Gujarat, Mr. Bupendra Patel, uh, respected State Cabinet Ministers of Gujarat, uh, representative of industries, ladies and gentlemen, uh, konnichiwa or namaste. Uh, my name is Suzuki. Um, I'm from uh, Japan Excellent Trade Organization. Japan is a government organization which is promoting uh, any business uh, happening between India and Japan. First of all, uh, big congratulations to 20 years anniversary of uh, Vibrant Gujarat. I would like to extend my uh, sincere appreciation to uh, Gujarat state government for sparing this time uh, to us, Jetro, uh, to share our journey of uh, associating with Vibrant Gujarat. Uh, this warm gesture signifies depths of cooperation between India, Gujarat, and Japan, Jetro. And also your clear recognition uh, that Japan is the number one contributor to Making India Initiative. Thank you. And uh, it gives me immense pleasure to share with all of you that uh, Jetro has been the first partner organization to Vibrant Gujarat since 2009. Uh, Gujarat has deepened business and cultural linkages with Japan under the guidance of Sri uh, Narendra Modi ji. On his insistence and recommendation, we opened project office in Ahmedabad in 2013. Uh, this project office was to facilitate investment of Japanese companies to Mandau ZIDC. And this Mandau ZIDC is one of the dedicated industrial park only for Japanese companies. As Japan is the only country that has such dedicated uh, country-focused industrial townships in India, we all know this is our privilege. To take advantage of our uh, privilege further, we have upgraded our project office in Ahmedabad into a full-fledged Jetro regional office in July 2018. At the same time, we opened a business support center uh, that provides a rental office spaces to new investors from Japan to set up their business in Gujarat. And uh, as a current result, we already have almost uh, 360 Japanese companies, offices and factories in Gujarat. And in Mandar ZRDC, nine Japanese companies are under operation for their manufacturing. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm really happy to tell you that we are now, after COVID, and uh, the biggest ever momentum between us is coming. Uh, we have five offices in India, and every office is very busy receiving the guests and business teams from Japan, and we discuss every day about their future business in India. So Jetro uh, now promotes Japanese business opportunities in Gujarat into more diversified sectors like semiconductor, green hydrogen, renewable energy, electronics, and the pharmaceutical sectors. We also started to work with the startup ecosystem in Gujarat to be connected to Japanese industries. Even before next vibrant Gujarat, we plan to invite one uh, Japanese business delegation uh, focusing on the semiconductor electronics, uh, which will happen 8 to 9 November. Of course, we will again organize Japanese business delegation for next vibrant Gujarat. Uh, we would like to show every new opportunity and happening in Gujarat to attract them. And I wholeheartedly thank Honorable Prime Minister Shri Narendra Modi ji for his important guidance and vision to make India best place for investment. I also thank Honorable Chief Minister of Gujarat for extending support to us always. The state administration is always available with necessary support to us. And lastly, as the most trusted partner organization, Jetro expresses again our commitment to work together with Gujarat, explore the new opportunity and relation between India and Japan. Thank you very much.